and Chavez was arrested. Roads remain closed near Roswell after one train crashed into another. The accident killed a person and left behind a major mess. Sky 7 flew over the wreckage this morning just south of the city near Dexter. Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain explains what investigators know so far and the clues they hope to find. From Sky 7's viewpoint, the aftermath of Tuesday morning's train crash in Roswell. State police say Jesse Coburn of Texaco, New Mexico was killed. Another person was airlifted to the hospital and is now in stable condition. Both were aboard the locomotive painted orange. Pretty bad scene. State police say that train was going southbound when it hit the other train, which was sitting still on the same track. Investigators believe the two victims saw the collision coming and tried to save themselves. It appears that they actually jumped from the train uh, prior to impact. Now crews face the task of cleaning up all this wreckage along with the diesel that spilled after impact. The National Transportation Safety Board is in charge of combing through debris, photos and other clues to figure out how and why one train slammed into the other. It's a pretty extensive scene. We're told cleaning up this mess will likely take several days and the investigation into the crash could take even longer. Laura Turin, KOAT Action 7 News. Santa Fe Deputy